that isn't that just too adorable a little lion cub snoozing they've managed to make their way into a little bit of shade i can still hear elephants all around us and i was so excited with what was going on a bit earlier i forgot to introduce myself my my name is brent and on camera with me today is brian and brian has got a double patched pirate thumb today and sometimes when brian and I are out on drive together we are known as the killer bees because we find all the killer sightings. And hopefully this evening is going to turn into one of those. Those elephants are going to move up towards these lines again. We're not going to move anywhere. So this is the Inkahuma pride, our main pride of lions that we see on Juma. Now they've had quite an up and down last two years. And over the course of this afternoon, I'm going to be giving you a bit of their history. So when I started, there were nine individuals, or 10 if you include a young male in this pride. And uh, there were two big males called the Matimbas. And when I first started, there were only two cubs or three cubs, if you want to call them, or sub-adults with this pride. And that has changed. And only one of those three is still here. And there's a lot of different reasons for this. And the main reason for that is the Birmingham boys. And there we go, there is a Birmingham boy lying next to them. This Birmingham boy has got a wound in his face at the moment, and we'll explain about that a little bit later. So in about October last year, the Birmingham boys really made a big push at taking over the Matimba males territory. And we happened to be there for the first time. We think they actually really interacted. Now for the Nkuma pride, this was a really big problem and they had sub-adults that they had to try protect from these males. If these males got hold of them, they would kill them. But we'll find out more about this after the break. Okay, so as everyone knows, we are practicing for for TV at the moment, so there is no advert really. And this, uh, what are we selling on your thumb today, Brian? Uh, eye patches. Eye patches, there we go. We had an advert. Right, let's put the eye patch advert in. There we go, here it comes. Buy your eye patches at thethumb.com. Maybe, okay. the, maybe the pirate will supply you with all your eye patches that are needed to supply. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Uh, so we're going to be telling the Inkahuma's story over this, uh, this drive. So we, we really get it really waxed. Um, for when we go to TV and we hopefully get a whole bunch of new viewers to come join us on this incredible ride that is Safari Live. Dina says, what a beautiful carpet of cats. It is, it is very much uh, a big cat rug at the moment. I can still hear the elephants, they're not too far off. And I do think they're probably going to harass the lions. So over the course of the day, it looks like the lions have been pushed by the eddies uh, probably two or three times. And actually, just as we arrived and we found them before drive started, they were walking away from where the elephants were coming from. Now, if you listen carefully, you can just hear the odd branch break. It's quite a big herd of elephants, at least 30 or 40 of them there. And we're going to sit here with the incredible in Kahumas. And while we do that, let's go see how Jamie's doing way down in the east. <laughs> 